What I want to do is talk to you a little bit about uh, some of the things we've been working on around Java technology and IBM, specifically around Java and cloud, um, and Java and some of the trends that we're seeing around hardware and new languages. One of the areas I think is really interesting is this idea of multi-tenancy or density, and how can we move up the spectrum? What happens is your 100 instances of your app server use 20% less memory and come up 30% faster because you are actually caching computation, loading time and jitting time. 30% is a big deal. So that's what we mean by share more. What we've done with our Liberty profile introduced this year is we've created what we call a lightweight runtime for the cloud. We cooperate with live app migration. So if you're going to tell an application, we're moving you from that machine to that machine, no problem. However, if that application is not very cooperative, it's dirtying memory at high rates of speed, it's garbage collecting, it's jitting. If you cooperate, you can support functionality in cloud like 2x faster app migration. Now, this one's cool, so I'm going to take a little time here. System Z, mainframes. Cheer if you love mainframes. Woo! All right. There you go. Oracle and IBM work together on Java. But we compete, and we compete like mad. Competition drives innovation. We are head-to-head -head competing, and innovation is good for our customers who get better performance, highly optimized runtimes, and it's really, really good for developers. Java, I think, finds itself now in a world where it is one important member of a collection of technologies that developers are using to build their applications. And we need to make sure that Java works well. 